Okay, folks, now let's have a little fun. In serious training, we're going to shoot some long-range distances. We're going to start at 10 yards. We're going to work our way all the way back to 50. The purpose of the drill is to find out what our capabilities are with our weapon system. But again, we can have a little bit of fun. If you have a shooting partner, bets on dinner or anything else that you think are appropriate away from the range are certainly in order. It's usually family bragging rights in my family when my wife and I or my son and I shoot for this. In other words, it gets pretty brutal. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to start at 10 yards and we'll work 10, 15, 25, 35, and 50. At each position, you have three opportunities, three shots to get a single hit. Again, you're seeing what your capacity is to, to score effective hits at longer range. Goes back to what we talked about earlier about a weapon system that has capacity, capabilities, and horsepower to get things done if that is the shot that is presented in your circumstances. So let's see what we can do. We're here at 10 yards. It's our first iteration at this position, so we need to make ready. partial magazine. Let's get a full magazine in that pistol. We're going to come to low ready. So administrative movement here. I'm going to track my pistol. I'm going to go ahead and put a full magazine in the mag pouch. All right. Let's see what we can, see what we can do at 10 yards. All right. Good hit on the target. Work our way back to the holster. Let's go back to 15. We'll talk about some of the issues as we increase distance. So here we are at 15 yards. This really is precision shooting distance for most people, me included, folks. So what do we need to do to score a hit? Well, we're going to shoot all of this standing offhand. We're not going to brace on anything. We're going to really see what our capacity is and push our capabilities. The key to success is a strong shooting posture, good position, a good, strong, balanced fighting position, good, strong grip on the gun, watch the front sight and press. Now, when I start pressing the trigger, I'm going to continue to press, and I'm going to really concentrate on the front sight and my sight alignment. The mistake that people will make is they get a little antsy, they get a little excited, and their eyes begin to bounce back and forth between their gun and the target. Stay locked on your sights and press, applying one pound of pressure at a time until the shot breaks. Let's see what we can do. All right, we got a good hit on the target on our first shot. The shooting gods must be smiling on me today. Let's go back to 25. Okay. So here we are at 25 yards. We're really pushing the envelope for most people here. But again, go ahead and push. You're on a range. Take advantage of it, folks. Apply your fundamentals. See what you've got. Good hit. All right. Complete my scan. Let's make things exciting. Let's go to 35. All right. The sun is just at a perfect angle back here at the 35 yard line. It's going to be reflecting off the sights, but that's okay. That may be your situation. You have to learn to deal with it. So let's see what we've got. First shot was a mess. Second shot hit. All right. 
Time for 50, folks. Let's go. Okay, folks, now we're getting pretty sporty. Here we are at 50 yards. This is a challenge for most shooters, me included. Here at Gunsight, we have ranges everything from contact distance out to several thousand yards. I will regularly take my pistol off to the Woodfill range, which is a 400 yard range with the tower, or to the Yark range, which is a 200 yard, and I'll stretch the limits. I'll see what I can do. I will tell you, I have hit a shot at 300 yards with this pistol, proving once again that even a blind squirrel finds a nut. On that day, got my shot, holstered the pistol, and left the range. 50 yards is a difficult shot standing offhand, but again, we're seeing what our capabilities are, and we're pushing the envelope. So let's see what we've got. Okay, bad day for Bob. Close, but no cigar. So I know today, 35 was my limit. Okay, we'll come out on another day. We'll miss at 35 and hit all three at 50. Apply the fundamentals. Push your limits as much as you possibly can. And folks, don't be afraid to fail on the range. Push it. Fail here. Fail quickly, push on, do something else. 